and contain written audit program explaining auditing procedures necessary to accomplish audit objectives as well as be constructed in such a way to enable an experienced reviewer to so we're talking about another reviewer if we're taking a look at this documentation it's supporting our opinion what if someone else was to look at that documentation and see whether it does indeed support our opinion it has to be constructed in such a way that an experienced reviewer of that documentation could understand the nature timing extent and results of audit procedures evidence obtained and conclusions reached and determine who performed and reviewed the work show that the dates of the work and the reviews of it so the documentation of course should give the evidence and a third party who is experienced with documentation related to audits should be able to understand the nature timing extent and results and the working paper should also indicate who did the procedures and who's in charge as well so we'll often have initials or some type of initial or signature process saying hey this is the